this moment, this hour. It ain't no doggone tomorrow, fellas. What are you going to bring to the doggone table? Are you going to bust somebody in their mouth? Are you going to do your doggone job? Are you going to pray from your doggone chest? Are you going to pray from your heart and get everything you doggone got? Because I'm going to do that. And I'm going to give you everything I doggone got on every plate. I need that to know. Look, it's me. Weapon X. And I'm clocking back in with the work for you boys. Now, hear me out. N'Kobe Dean is helping uh, Jonathan Gannon install plays and install certain looks and fronts and coverages and things of that nature. Um, and if if you really just read between the lines, you can figure out exactly what we're going to do. We're going to be running a Georgia style defense. All right, that's why they went and got Jordan Davis. That's why they that's when they went. That's why they went and got Nicobe Dean. If you look at some of the um, the acquisitions that they brought in, or some of the players they brought in, um, it's I did. It's an ideal fit. They they got they have a lot of these smaller linebackers that can rush the passer and that can get to the quarterback and that can move from sideline to sideline. And then you get these big defensive linemen, these uh, interior linemen um, to kind of kind of um, solidify the, the middle part of that defense so that these guys can move around. And you got speedy edge, rush, edge rushers, smaller edge rushers like Hassan Reddick, Who's going to be coming off the edge as a linebacker? Um, the the um, rookie Kyron Johnson. So the the defense is pretty going to the defense is pretty much going to look like a three four and a four three and a four two five nickel. It's going to be it's like it's going to be like an exotic, weird kind of defense to where like at any given moment they can switch and play whatever um, defense they feel is suitable um, and will help, you know, uh, win games, you know? So it's, it's, uh, it's gonna be it's gonna be determined based off, uh, and that's what I love about Nick, uh, Nick Sirianni and his coaching staff, right? Jonathan Gannon, he just didn't have the pieces to do it. Um, but for sure, Nick, N'Kobe Dean, he's definitely installing things with him, right? And he, I, I feel like he can come in day one and be a captain and be a leader. Um, now, some of the leaders on our team, Brandon Graham, Fletcher Cox, uh, players like that, Lane Johnson, they're getting older, and um, you know, they, you understand you need a, a, a you need a infusion of young players, right, to carry that torch and help lead the team, you know, and be productive. And I don't think they'll have a problem with it. Uh, they don't. We don't have. They. They don't have a choice. Some guys are just natural born leaders, and the Kobe Dean is that. So, um, you can definitely expect the Kobe Dean to be. Um, I know it's crazy to think a rookie is coming in and installing different coverages and installing different uh, fronts and defenses and looks. But his fingerprint, his, his blueprint is going to be all over this. You know because. In order to, what better way to to create, uh, to duplicate a Georgia style defense? Because Georgia's defense, it was like a, it was it was probably not only was it the best uh, defense in college football history, but a lot of NFL coaches they take everything from college. They take all of these new schemes and looks. They take them from college because that's where it starts. Then they just take it and bring it to the NFL. And that's what they're doing with this Georgia style defense. So I'm excited that Kobe Dean will be helping them install um, some looks. So let me know how y'all feel about that. Um, Weapon X, clocking out.